all right you guys so if you pick this very bland kitchen then this is your reading and i'm just gonna channel real quick when i saw this i was just like this is a this is a kitchen that i would not want to be raised in i don't know why movies always project like the round table and the like this is like it gives me these people who live in this house beat their kids or either they don't pay attention to their kids or either they don't even like like they accidentally had kids they had to get married because somebody got pregnant it's just really bland like i don't see anybody's picture i don't know i don't see no pictures it's just really bland it gives me like don't nobody really just live there they exist there if that makes sense so let's get into this reading it gives me narcissists live there like they don't they don't people didn't allow them to live so they don't allow their kids or anybody else to live but if you grew up in a nice household and i'm not channeling your energy right then i do i hope you find another a beautiful room and you resonate okay but going back to this picture, 11, 11 on the clock, this is the type of household, like this kitchen, I would always be in my room. I would go to the kitchen, get my sandwich, and I would literally go to my room to eat it. I wouldn't even sit at the kitchen table because it's just the vibe here. I don't like it. Some of you guys are like, yes, I, I my house looks completely different from that house now. I've moved on. I don't, I don't think about my childhood anymore. What came out instantly was strength. I feel like you would have the type of you would have to have strength to live in this household. I just feel like instantly I feel tense. I feel anxious. Um, some of you guys have to learn how to be strong at a young age because like these people tried your patience. Some of you guys had like suffer from heart palpitations or like your heart was like always like your chest was always tight when growing up. Um. I feel like you had like a um a very emotionally abusive mother. I feel like she tried to dictate everything. I feel like she was really like she was loud even when she didn't say anything. Her energy was very intense. You moved away from these people as soon as you could, but you were kind of nervous. Some of you guys, these people are the reason why you doubt yourself or was the reason why you doubted yourself. Oop, we got a card, a couple cards. That's the Ace of Wands. So some of the you guys really like this person like made your heart heavy or like made you like real dark. This person could have seen you at this person could have crucified you. This person could have always like hung you up to dry at all times. Like this person could light you up about anything. Like why would you leave this dish in the sink? Like the littlest things. It gives me like people who yell at their kids. It gives me like people who like just like feel like their kids make their kids feel like they're nothing. Yeah, like this person, it could have been like you could have been in a same sex um like your parents could have been same sex for some, not all. You could have had a big sister that was also narcissistic and, deme uh, and demeaning. You guys could always be like in arguments or you could always be in disagreements. It's like when you got home from school, you definitely didn't want to like talk to anybody. You went straight to your room. Um, some of you guys really have to grow out of that. Some of you guys really hit like the jackpot when you were able to leave. It was like once you left there or you got out of this house, you guys felt free. You were like accomplishing things. You know, you weren't doing the best. You know, you could have been struggling. Everybody struggled when they first get out there. You got to figure some stuff out, you know. But I feel like you guys figured that shit out and you made it work for you. You guys planned. You guys did what you needed to do. Y'all were really resourceful. Like, I feel like your child, for you to pick this picture, pile number, uh, I'm talking about pile number, it ain't no number. For you to picture, pick this picture, I feel like you guys are low-key plagued by um your upbringing. I feel like some of you guys could be about to be new parents, too, and that kind of comes up. Like, you want to know how what kind of parent you're going to be, or you feel like already that you're going to be hard on yourself. 
about how you parent, even though, like, you didn't have no, like, you know, some stuff we can't, we can't help, but, like, doing better, we can do that. Some of you guys are also, like, not talking to your parents, and that's their justice, like, they don't get to, like, know what's going on when it comes to you. Four of Swords, you stay to yourself. Holidays, they don't see you. You find a vac, you do a vac, you have a vacation, or you figure out what your other friends are doing, and you go there. Some of you guys left for college, and after that, that was it. You never came back. I saw this um episode on Hoarders, and these people, this guy was like, I haven't been here in 10 years. I was glad when I moved, and I hate that I came back. Literally in front of his mom. And that was crazy, but in my mind, I'm like, if it's this bad and she's old, imagine how bad it was when they were a kid. You know what I'm saying? So, that's that. So, we have the four of coins, too. I feel like this. your parents don't feel like they can talk to you, neither. They feel like they've messed up as well. So, they stay to themselves, and they let you stay to yourself. Because they feel like you're going to cut them up with what you have to say about them. Yeah. They see you as, like, evil. They see you as, like, literally the black sheep of the family. Like, they may, like, figure find anything to be mad at you about just so they can feel like you know they have they have some oh uh, oh they're mad at me i don't like them either because it is like some leverage but i feel like you guys are manifesting very well like i said you guys could be pregnant you guys could you guys could have just got pregnant or somebody is pregnant now and watching this if it's not for you don't take it i'm just saying because the empress and the magician came out by each other and i had just said it before i pulled those cards yeah it's something that's happening really fast i don't know i want to say like I want to say that you guys could be finding love fast. This could be a future prediction, too, for some of you guys. Like, y'all could be, like, finding love and somebody could be getting pregnant for you. Or you could be getting pregnant for somebody. I feel like it's going to be somebody you could have viewed as toxic or something as well. I hope this, this is freeing for you guys. I hope this is, like, releasing. Because I didn't come up from, like, I had two different households that I lived in. So, like, I kind of feel what, I feel what you guys are saying, like, dead ass. Some people didn't have anywhere to go. At least I had somewhere that I could duck off to. So, you guys got the four of cups. And you guys had a five of cups. So, it's giving me, like, you guys are really picking your poison. When it comes to people, I feel like your upbringing taught you how to pick your poison because I feel like with a narcissist, they give other people the greatest mask, but then they give the people, they don't give the people that they love any mask. Like it's straight demon all the time. You guys might be the power that actually gets 10 minutes today. We have temperance here. Some of you guys really have to like take a hold of your mental health as well. And I feel like you guys feel like even now it's like you're steady trying to take hold of it. It's like you feel like you haven't made any progress trying to take care of your mental health. I'm here to tell you I'm looking at your energy. I'm feeling your mind. And you guys took every step you needed to take. You 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 went no contact and you didn't break it. You said I'm focusing on me and you did that. That's 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 progress. I'm I'm congratulating you at this point. That's the true spirit said he congratulates you too. And it's like you continue, you need to continue to look out for the snake because Satan is steady around. Like, you guys feel like it's around or that energy is around. You got accustomed to the energy of the enemy. So, if you feel like it's around, guess what? It's around. We got the seven of of swords excuse me the seven of wands here and i said seven of swords so that means boom with the ace of coins and the world that's the truth it's a lot of people that are, that don't want to see you succeed because they're actually minions of the de of the demon like the of the evil spirit they don't they secret they act like they want to see you go do good and succeed and get this and get that they don't they really don't. They really talk bad about you. And I feel like that's something that you should not care about. I know it's something that you don't care about. Care about that bag that you're about to get because it's coming. You guys have not went through anything in vain. Everything is about to get paid back to you. You guys just got to stay focused and stay clear-headed and definitely get to it. 
okay please like please share please subscribe i hope this reading resonated for you i have the comments cut off because this is this is just uh, open this is not for anybody this is just for anybody you know if it's for everybody great but if it's not it's not so y'all i'm gonna see y'all next time